Hello, Skinner. It's always a pleasure to come to your humble abode. Chalmers, it's great to see you. What brings you here today? Oh, I'm flattered. I'm glad you think of me as a friend. Of course, Seymour. You always go above and beyond for your students and staff. Thank you, sir. I just want to make sure everyone is taken care of. And speaking of taking care, I have a surprise for you, too. I made something special for lunch today. What is it? It's called Eleocaris dulcis. It's a type. It's a type of sweet grass that's native to Asia. The smell from the kitchen is heavenly. Wow, Seymour. You never cease to amaze me with your culinary skills. Thank you, sir. I'd just like to make sure that we're taking care of ourselves as well. Ah, uh, I burnt the Eleocaris dulcis. This was supposed to be a special meal, and now it's ruined. All right, let's think of something fun to do next. How about trying out a new recipe for dinner? I have an idea. Skinner looks out the window and sees a shop that sells shiro, a Japanese sweet. He thinks to himself, this could be a great substitute for the burnt Eleocaris dulcis. I'm gonna get it. Skinner climbs out the window and heads to the shop. As he enters, the owner greets him with a smile. Skinner explains his situation and asks if there is any shiro that could replace Eleocaris dulcis. The owner shows him some options, and Skinner finally chooses one. Skinner talks about how he plans to prepare this new dish. He says, I'm gonna mix this shiro with some cream and serve it as a dessert. It's gonna be amazing. Feeling proud of his quick thinking, Skinner climbs back in through the window with the shiro in hand. He smiles to himself, knowing that he has saved the dish from being ruined. Can't wait to try this out. What are you doing with that steamer? The kitchen is filled with smoke. Bill, hey, Chalmers. I, I was just trying out a new recipe for Eliochorus dulcis. Skimmer, that's not steam coming from the kitchen. It's smoke. I know, I know. But I promised Puddles I would make him a steamed version of Eleocaris dulces for his birthday. I... I had to get it just right. Skinner, you can't seriously expect me to believe that. That's not steam, it's smoke. I swear! Chalmers. Yeah, it's just a little bit of smoke. I promise it's not a big deal. Skinner, you know I can't tolerate this kind of behavior. Clean up this mess and make sure it doesn't happen again. Yes, Chalmers. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> I don't understand why I was served Eleocaris dulcis instead of steamed Eleocaris dulcis as promised. It's the same thing, Chalmers. Eleocaris dulcis is just the standard term for this dish. Well, I'm not buying it, Skinner. I have had steamed Eleocaris dulcis before, and this definitely doesn't taste like it. Trust me, Chalmers. All regional variations of a dish are essentially the same. You just might not be familiar with this particular one. Fire! Someone called the fire department. I don't know what's going on, but it can't be good. We have to do something. Let's grab some water and try to put it out. Ah! 
No way. We can't just stand by and let our house burn down. Let's go.